G'day, my name's Jason Hodges. I'm the Landscape Gardener on Better Homes and Gardens on Channel 7. But long before that, and far more importantly to me, I'm a Bears fan. I was born one, and I will be till the day I die. Just recently, Norse played Newcastle in the preliminary final. It was the only game on in Sydney, and all the radio stations covered it. Every announcer said how good it was to watch two of the foundation clubs. The word foundation is thrown around all the time when they talk about rugby league. Foundation means it was one of the clubs that started the game. So if Norse was building a house, they were the bricklayers and the plumbers, the carpenters and the electricians that build our house. And that's the catch cry for the game these days. Well, as a Norse supporter, I want to move back into the house, and I'm sure you do too. If you're a supporter of another club, I'm sure you want to see the Bears back in the comp. It makes sense on so many levels. They want to expand the game and compete with the opposition. AFL is doing a fantastic job. You only have to look at the success of the Sydney Swans over the past 20 or 30 years who still have foundation support back in Melbourne where they came from. Norse can do exactly the same thing. Own the game from the Harbour Bridge all the way up the highway, all the way up the expressway and all of the Central Coast. If you want to build the game on tradition, a new club on the Central Coast would be exactly the right step to make. Imagine the rivalry against Manly, the foundation games against South and the Tigers. Teams like that would love to play against the old Bears, but you'd also be including probably about a million people on the Central Coast who would have a team to support. And you'd start a new rivalry with Newcastle. That game would be sold out months before the kickoff. North Sydney is still around, but we want to move to the Central Coast. When the Bears were going well, they were the first club to think about moving and looking to a new future. That future's still there on the Central Coast. To the new commission and the new board, congratulations on your appointment. I hope that you can have a look inside and see what it would feel like if your team was gone. So what can we do as supporters? Well, put on the old red and black. Even get the dog collar red and black. Put a sticker on the car and start a conversation with a friend or a family member about the Bears. If you can get another person to help, it's another pair of hands. Start a conversation with a stranger. Everyone's sick of talking about politicians and real estate prices. Talk about the Bears and start an interesting conversation. Talk about tradition and the future. And what we want to ask the Commission is three things. Do you want to turn your back on tradition? The people that built the house that you're living in. Do you want to turn your back on a new heartland, the Central Coast, which could easily be taken over by any other sport? And what do we have to do to get back in the NRL? I'm going to write a letter, I'm going to put it up on our website, and I hope you follow me and support the Mighty Bears.